Hey everybody, Randy Myers Homestead and Timber Products. This is the swarm trap that I put up at the farm. The homestead here. And they had the bees on the bottom. The bees have moved from the bottom and they're in the box. I wasn't for sure yesterday. There was one bee on the outside just sitting right at the opening like that one just landed. Just sitting there. I watched him doing chores and stuff. He never moved. So the curiosity got the best of me. And I got a ladder. And I opened the box up. And the bees are inside. There's probably about mm, 3,000, 4,000 bees in there. Maybe. I'm not a bee expert. I don't know. But that's what I would estimate. I guess they're just uh, coming and going to grab pollen. I took the sugar water off the top. I put it down here on this one. It was leaking and dripping down. But you can see they fly around the top and get the residuals off and all that good stuff. But uh, they're in there. And as soon as they got a, a frame or two built up, I think there's five frames in that one. As soon as they get uh, two or three frames built up, I'll pull that, I'll close that uh, little blue thing so they can't get out. And then I'll pull it off that tree and then I'm going to stick those frames in that box in our in our uh, apiary that we're going to make. We've got it cleaned out. We just haven't done much to it. So, anyway, that's where we're at with this uh, swarm catcher. It worked. I'm glad this had the uh, uh, swarm commander little uh, air freshener type thing whatever it was it worked good I use the spray in our city house it works good but for some reason the bees don't like that box they did not they'll go in it when this, this swarm commander is strong but for some reason they won't build out the hive I'm not for sure if they're ready to swarm or not or whatever but anyway I'm gonna keep trying there but there's where we're at with this swarm this hive that swarmed in there y'all take care